What is going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of King Customs and today is finally the day that this vehicle is gonna get started. I don't care what happens, we are getting it started today. I'm not leaving this garage until it turns on. So that's what we're gonna do coming up. What's up guys? So let me tell you everything that's going on right now with this vehicle. So we all we have to do is put on the air box, put on the battery, add some oil, add some coolant, and fire this puppy up. So let's get started. About to hook this up and try to start it. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. I forgot the key. We gotta go get the key. All right. So what we're gonna do is we have some coolant in the funnel. I'm gonna make sure to stand by in case it drops down because it will. I have some oil. I put in four quarts. Um, I know it's gonna need a little bit more because we have a brand new filter. And it's going to suck in all the oil throughout all the crevices. So it's going to need a little bit more. But it's good enough to get us started for now. And what I'm going to do is put the key in. Prime the fuel. Prime the fuel pump. Let fuel come into the injectors. And then hopefully it starts up, guys. Wish me luck. Eek! It's gonna start, it's pulling fuel, it's pulling fuel, and I forgot to put the serpentine belt on to keep the battery charged, so let me get that on real quick. You're almost there, you're almost there. Alrighty guys, so this was so exciting. The engine actually started, um, but we ran into a little problem. It seems like it's idling super, super, super rough. Like there's a misfire and I know I got everything, but now I'm noticing there's this one hose that's missing and I'm gonna show you where it is. I have no idea what this diagram's for or what actually comes out from it, but let's see. Um, so if you look right there, Right there on, here's the throttle body, right over there. There you go, you see it, that little stub? It seems like um, air is either sucking in or something from there, so it's a vacuum line of some sort, and I don't know where whatever goes to, but I'm noticing a wiring diagram, well not a wiring diagram, a vacuum diagram right here that can possibly tell me what it is. If not, I'm gonna go to my friend uh, Peter, he's gonna print me out a diagram and it'll help me uh, see what's missing other than that. I'm so happy that the engine started. I hope the timing is correct I know I corrected it um, Before I put it in so I hope it's something small and nothing huge it did start up obviously the normal smoke and whatnot um, It was squirting out a lot of fuel from injector number three and that's because I forgot to tighten on the fuel rail So I retightened that and it started to run awesome and uh, then it had this misfire which is most likely the cause from that vacuum line, I hope. Um, if not, I'll have one of my friends come over and give me a hand to kind of figure out what it is. And I'm also gonna borrow a Peter scan tool to just scan the motor, make sure everything is up and running. And then finally we'll button down everything and put it all together. So hopefully we can figure it out. But with that being said guys, battery's about to die. I hope you guys enjoyed this really, really quick clip or episode, and if you did, please make sure to hit the like button on this video, and also, if you can, please make sure to subscribe if you're not a subscriber, and again, hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm, and leave some comments in the comment section below. Love you all. Peace out.